video that I have for you guys that it's, it's exciting for me. Um, I ordered this from Distortions Unlimited, and this was a prop that I had my eye on for the longest time. I'm talking maybe two, three years. And uh, I finally, you know, I finally took, uh, took the uh, opportunity to buy it. And now I have it. So it actually came in the mail today. I'm very excited. First, uh, like official Distortions Unlimited prop. Um, it's nothing too fancy or, you know, like a, a static prop, but it was something that I had my eye on for a while. And um, I, fi I, fi I was finally able to get it. So we're about to unbox it. We're going to review it. I'm so excited for you guys. This thing is just awesome. Like I said, I had my eyes on it for the last uh, three years or so, and I finally got it. So I was like, you know what? I'm I need to get this. And it's kind of like a tattoo because once you get one you can't stop you're gonna want more and i want more and i already found another prop that i'm gonna be getting um right after this one uh because one thing i love about klarna is they buy you know you shop and then you know they pretty much do the whole payment for you and then you just pay in for payments so you can it's just klarna has been a very good friend of the channel and no they're not promoting me or anything like that but anyway we're gonna open it safety first kids and uh, I'm really excited because, one, I, I love Halloween and, and distortions. I, I met Ed a while ago at the Mask Fest, which I believe it was 2019. Uh, very nice guy, awesome guy. I, I loved his show um, that was on that they had, Making Monsters. And, you know, he even has a web series um, or had a web series where they teach you how to sculpt and stuff like that. And it's just awesome. Um, I'm kind of getting into the sculpting stuff myself and um it's just very informative it teaches you how to you know what to look for how to do it you know very exciting very nice guy and uh you know i highly recommend if you are into something like that and you ever get a chance to meet him at a convention definitely meet him super nice guy but here we go this is the jackalicious this is the jack-o-lantern candy bowl that i ordered from them and i'm very excited because like i said the one thing being a halloween channel um the, the basic Halloween images, you know, if I were to pick one, like an image that represents Halloween, it'll definitely be a jack-o'-lantern. And uh, this, oh my lord, this is big. Hold on, let me put this down. Um, I, I just love jack-o'-lanterns. I love pumpkins in general. So here is the top. Now it is made out of uh, latex and foam. So you have a little foam top, okay? But there's the top of it. Very nice detail in sculpting, the coloring. You can tell it's a pumpkin that's been starting to age, starting to rot. That's really cool. So this is the top of the pumpkin bowl um, that I got, the Jackalicious, but that is crazy. All that detailing actually looks like the stem of a pumpkin. And then the nice detailing right there on the pumpkin for age, rot, all that good stuff. All right, so. Sorry about that. I was trying to fix the fix the camera for you guys and it ended up shutting off. But all right, so there we go. We got the stem, rotten pumpkin look. Very cool. So now we're gonna take out Jack. And I'm really excited. Cause this thing is amazing. Look at this. Alright, so it's a candy bowl, okay? So it is um you put some candy up on top and uh you know you can walk around and um put a uh, candy pass that out if you wanted to so let me put the top on so you guys can see it all together we gotta figure out which piece goes where that's the good thing about the tops of pumpkins is figuring out the puzzle but anyway fits pretty snug up on top but check this out so here we go now boom there is jackalicious this thing is freaking ridiculous um, you can see by the size, he is, he's huge. Um, he is hollow, made out of foam and latex. Um, that way he can sit there wherever it is that you're going to want him to be put at. But this thing is freaking cool. I've waited about three, four years uh, that I wanted this thing and I'm, I'm finally getting him. But look at that. Look at all that detail, that sculpt job, the painting. I mean, even if you look all around behind it, you just see all the age and pumpkins starting to decay and all that good stuff. Look at that. That is just phenomenal. Distortions Unlimited is really good with their props. Um, I know as it gets closer to Halloween, you want to put your orders in for whatever it is you're going to get. Because with so many orders for haunted houses and, and private haunters and stuff like that, um, 
they get pretty busy but i think they do it pretty good to where they get so many orders and say these orders will be completed by this month so on and so forth but uh yeah nothing but nothing but good reviews on on distortions especially from me uh like i said ed is amazing it, it was fast shipping they, they got this done uh, i think i bought this in july or august and uh it was shipping out uh the end of uh august and I just got it. So, um, I mean, it's understandable. Halloween season's coming up. It's going to be pretty busy. So, um, <clears throat> you know, getting your props and stuff like that. I, I was no worries of, of worrying if I was going to get it or anything like that. I mean, like I said, I put in my order. I finally um, I finally bit the bullet and, and take it. But, I mean, look at that. Look at all that detail, that sculpt. That is one mean face right there. That is just awesome. The teeth, the coloring of the gums. If you guys can see there, it's got a nice glossy look to it, nice wet, some sharp teeth. And I, I just can't get over the coloring and the age of this thing. You can see that this guy has been around for a very long time, um, hassling people and God knows what else he was doing as a as an evil pumpkin over there trying to get people, lure them in with the candy and sweets and probably eating them. But I mean, the one thing I like, guys, is the eyes. If you can see inside the eyes there, like all that pumpkin like kind of guts and wrinkles inside there you got the nice crooked nose absolutely amazing i mean look at look at i mean he is pretty huge you guys can see how big he is i mean hell he's bigger than my head um but it, it's so cool because let's see if i can get it. it it's a pumpkin but you can see like his cheeks as he's smiling like part of the pumpkin all the wrinkles the cheeks the frowns the wrinkles absolutely phenomenal and like i said i'm very excited this is my very first distortions prop um and i absolutely love them i when i first saw him a couple years ago i knew i had to have them um and i always i always intended to order him and stuff like that but I just planning my own haunt um buying things that i need for it and everything like that i just i just either forgot or it was too late that if i were to order him i wouldn't get him in time for halloween and um you know, I ordered them and I have them. I plan to, when I do my costume, whatever theme that I, I plan to go with, um, I do plan to fill him up with candy and walk around and scare people with them. But very cool. I'm in love with that face. Just look at that. All that detailing, that coloring, wrinkles on the forehead. And I have n I have not found a video on, on this particular prop. I've seen some on some of the Distortions props, um, but I haven't found one on him. So... I'm hoping uh, other people will see this video or, or would be interested in him and, and look up the video and just see how awesome in person that this thing is. Now, I did see it <clears throat> one time at a convention. I can't remember which one, but I did see him sit on the table with the Distortions Unlimited, and I was just like, oh my God, it looks so much cooler in person. I have to order it. And uh, ended up not doing it. But this year, I definitely did. And I'm glad I did because I am absolutely happy with it. If this this pumpkin, this Jackalicious right here doesn't scream Halloween, I don't know what does. But I mean, just beautiful. The teeth, the gums, the wrinkles, the aging. Look at that. And it's a full size pumpkin. I mean, you don't have to worry about nothing like getting ripped off or half of anything. I mean, just beautiful, everything. The aging, the wrinkles, the coloring, the paint job was really good. I mean, it realistically looks like, um, I'm sure you guys can see it on the camera, but it looks like a legit pumpkin really cool and like i said the top part comes off right there you fill it with candy if you wanted to or you can hold your keys whatever it is that you'd like to do you can put the top on however you'd like um you can do it traditional but very cool so big thank you to ed and uh the uh people over at distortions unlimited very cool product you guys i love it you guys are awesome you guys rock um and like i said i do have another prop that i plan on buying um i'm probably gonna get it um before Halloween, I'll order it, but I probably won't get it till after, which is okay because I plan on starting my Distortions Unlimited collection, and I wanted to start it off right. I wanted to do with uh, the prop that I've had my eyes on for the longest time, and that's the Jackalicious. So I highly recommend it if you guys are interested in buying it or just from Distortions Unlimited in general. I highly recommend them. They're an awesome company. They they put out great products, and uh, I mean, just look at that. Everything in there from the smile. The glossy teeth, that face, that is one mean face. The eyes, the little wrinkles and stuff in the eyes. I mean, this thing has some depth to it. And it's just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Just look at that. Like a full-size monster pumpkin. That is... I'm really happy with this. So, 
I mean, just beautiful. First distortion prop of not only my Distortions Unlimited collection, but it's a good uh, addition to my horror collection in general, as you can see. Um, and one of the things, like I said, I was saying, I don't know if I explained it all the way, but if you had to select a basic image to represent Halloween, I think my favorite image would be of the jack-o'-lantern, uh, the pumpkins. And, uh, you know, I think this does a very good, um, a very good rep representation of Halloween. Uh, you can't go wrong and you can't have Halloween without a jack-o'-lantern or an evil pumpkin, pumpkin patch. That's just, it just goes with the fall and the Halloween and I absolutely love it. So I'm so excited to have this and it's going to be a perfect addition to the ho horror Halloween collection that I have down here. Super happy with it. Ed Distortions Unlimited. I, I love you guys. You guys are awesome. Um, I'm going to leave a link to the script in the description down below for you guys. So if you guys are interested in purchasing it, you guys can. Um, I highly recommend them. It's, it's really cool. Um, Edit and Distortions crew, if you guys are watching this, thank you. I appreciate it. You guys work so hard and I just want you to know that your hard work is greatly appreciated. Um, it's just absolutely beautiful all around. And uh, like I said, put your candy in there. There's your top. And it actually helps that it's hollow on the inside. So that way it kind of the round of the pumpkin helps uh, stand it up and stuff like that. And I'm pretty sure if you wanted to, you can probably fill it with foam so that way it's just one big full piece. But um, I'm pretty happy with it. I love it. I think it's pretty cool. Uh, thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, give a big thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button, that notification bell. Also, uh, consider becoming a patron um, on my Patreon. All that is in the description down below for you guys. Um, if you become a patron, not only do you get your name featured in all of my videos, but you also get some like sneak peeks and you know stuff that are specifically for my Patreon um, patrons. And uh, that's pretty much it. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, like I said, highly recommend Distortions Unlimited and uh, just amazing props. I can't wait to get the other prop that I have my eye on and do a review video for you guys. Uh, I think this is going to be really cool. Especially, I think this year what I'm going to do is a witchy pumpkin patch theme so he's gonna go absolutely awesome especially if i uh do a scarecrow costume or something like that walking around with this guy's gonna be awesome so thank you guys for watching i appreciate you be kind to somebody be safe don't be a monster and i will see you guys in the next video take it easy